Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are well and doing good. Today's recipe is paneer masala. First, I'm going to marinate the paneer. In a bowl, I have about 250 grams of paneer. I have half a teaspoon of haldi, turmeric, half a teaspoon of Kashmiri lal mirch, add one tablespoon of oil, and mix everything together. Just be very gentle. You don't want to break the paneer, or you can just get a bowl and just do this. This way you're not really breaking the paneer. We're going to leave this aside until we need it later. In the pan, I have half a cup of oil, add one teaspoon of cumin seeds, fry this for about 20 to 30 seconds. Here I have two medium sized onion. Fry this until the onion turns to golden brown. The onions have now changed colour. Add one teaspoon of ginger, one teaspoon of garlic. Saute this for a minute. Now add one and a half teaspoon of coriander powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric, aldi, half a teaspoon of garam masala, half a teaspoon of chili powder, one and a half teaspoon of salt, but that's to your taste, one teaspoon of cumin powder. Salt this for a minute. Now add one cup of tomato puree. Cook this until the oil starts separating. I'm gonna add half a teaspoon of food coloring, but that's optional, you don't need to. It just gives you a nice vibrant colour. I've added one and a half cup of water in here. Now I'm going to let this simmer on a medium heat until the oil starts separating. This has been cooking for about 15 minutes. Now I'm going to add one tablespoon of kasuri methi. I have one teaspoon of coarse black pepper. I'm going to add two tablespoons of yogurt. Cook this for a couple of minutes, then we'll add the paneer. Now add the paneer. After about a couple of minutes, I'm going to add half a litre of water. You can add as much water as you want. I've added half a litre. Now I'm going to add peppers, that's optional. Also had, I've got about three chilies, which I've cut in half. And let this simmer for about 10 to 15 minutes on a low heat. Okay, this has been simmering for about 15 minutes. I'm going to add a handful of coriander. And I'm just going to cover this for about two minutes and the paneer masala will be ready. The paneer masala is now ready. I hope you've enjoyed this recipe. If you have, please do try this. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the latest recipes. See you soon with a new recipe. Thank you.